So this is the Garmin Vivo Fit 3, the latest activity tracker from Garmin. And as you can see, it comes in a range of really, really attractive designs. The interesting thing about these activity trackers, it can automatically detect what activity you're doing, whether that's cycling, running, or even swimming. Because swimming isn't a problem thanks to the 50 meter submersion water limit that these things can handle. They've both got LED displays, which let you cycle through the usual stats. It's calorie intake, steps taken. It's also got a stopwatch on there as well. And the best thing is that they have a one year battery life. So there'll be no need to take these off. And because they're waterproof, you can even take them in the shower when you're swimming or in the bath. This is the second of Garmin's new activity trackers. This is the Vivo Active HR. And that combines the best of a fitness tracker and a smartwatch. So not only is it going to be able to track your fitness, and that's running, cycling, swimming, it's also going to be able to alert you when somebody phones you or you receive a text message. The Vivo Active HR has GPS as well, so you'll be able to keep track of where you're running and cycling. Garmin also claim that you'll get 13 hours battery life, even with the GPS active, and that's plenty of time for exercise through your day. The HR in the name stands for heart rate because this smartwatch will be able to monitor it. And it's not too bulky either. Often we've seen really bulky smartwatches that incorporate the heart rate monitor, but Garmin have managed to keep this one looking really nice and sleek. GPS on smartwatches is something that's renowned as a bit of a battery hog, so we'll be curious to see whether when it goes through our tests, it can live up to that 13 hour battery life claim. So whether you're after a fitness tracker in the Vivo Fit 3 or more of a smartwatch in the Vivo Active HR, Garmin have you covered with two great looking products that we're very curious to get in our test labs as soon as possible.